Hello everybody, welcome to another version of Cooking with Tony. Today we're going to make some turkey rice soup. And right now I'm cut up about a cup and a half of celery and one medium onion I cut into wedges and I'm browning. Okay, as you can see I added my stock and it's starting to heat up and turn into liquid. All oh, that beautiful turkey stock. I didn't film the stock recipe this time but in the future I will my next time and I will add a link to it to follow up. Right now that it's liquefying I'm going to add my carrots. Gonna add a pound of crinkle cuts. There we go. We're going to bring this to a boil and then we'll let it simmer for about 20 minutes. I'll be back. Alright, I'm getting a nice little boil here. So I'm gonna turn this down and let it simmer for 20 minutes. So this carrots will soften up a little bit. Look at how good that looks already. Hey everybody. It's been about 20 minutes and it's time to add the spices and the rice. But before I do that I just wanted to say if there's things that you like to add to it feel free to do it. There is no wrong way to make this soup and you will like it. Some people may like other vegetables or other spices and just make it your own just use mine as a guide but anyways let's get back to what we're doing throw it in the soup it will help enhance it with its flavors as well as help be a natural thickener to help thicken it up a little bit okay I add a little salt and pepper in the beginning I'm gonna add a little more salt flavor. The first time it was to bring out the flavor of the vegetables while I was sauteing them. And the black pepper. I just take the lid off and about that much. I'd usually add some bay leaf at this time but I'm running low on spices so no bay leaf today. I'm gonna add some thyme. Oh, that looks like a good amount of thyme right there. Let's see. Some sage. This is rub sage. I love sage. You can't really go wrong without sage, so add some sage. Alright, I'm going to add a little bit of poultry seasoning too. It has sage in it, but some other spices as well. So, I'm going to add a little bit of poultry seasoning. And I'm going to add some garlic. You could have add, if you want, you can add this in the beginning. Oh, that might be a little too much there after your vegetables are like halfway sauteed and my rice I'm gonna add about a cup and a half of rice you're gonna want to watch this because it's gonna absorb the moisture of your stock so you're gonna probably have to add a little more water to this or chicken stock or whatever you have. Oh that just smells so delicious. I can't wait to eat. So we're going to occasionally stir this and let it simmer for about another 20 minutes until the rice is tender and it should be time to eat. Add your turkey and then eat. As you can see the rice is absorbing up all the moisture, so I'm going to add some chicken broth to it. But 
This way we keep the flavors going. I'm adding some chicken broth to my turkey stock to compensate for the rice absorbing it all. And it's going to do a little more absorbing. So I'm just going to add the whole thing. Mm, look at that. I added the turkey to the rice and the vegetables and it's ready to go. So do a quick taste test here. Carrots are perfect. Everything just tastes delicious. I love turkey. Okay everybody, rice. thank you again for watching another episode of Cooking with Tony. I hope you enjoyed it and learned a few things. Feel free to share and subscribe if you like and thank you again for all your support and 